Hi everyone, it's Raven and I'm here with Mariah Balenciaga and we're here with another episode of RuPaul's Drag Race Fashion Photo Review. Hi, drag fans all over the world. I am Manila Luzon. I want you all to come to RuPaul's Drag Con in Los Angeles on May 11, 12, and 13. Three days of drag con. It's gonna be the biggest RuPaul's Drag Con ever! So get your tickets now at RuPaul'sDragCon.com. Something smells nice. Mmm, I farted. <laughs> we are tooting and booting the looks from the main stage of season three All Stars of. Where's Raja? She missed her bus. Dang, sis. But fortunately, I'm here with you. Yay! And I'm so happy because this is episode four. The bees are buzzing. All over us. Look at us. Just a absolute couple of floral dripping in fake flower realness. Oh, that's dripping a category in flake, now. Fake flower eleganza. The queens had to wear fake flowers on the main stage. Oh, this should be fun. It gives them a lot to work with. What are you wearing today? Rosebuds. <laughs> of course you are. And I'm wearing a virginal sapling. And we believe that. First up. Aja. Wearing a lovely little pastel pink capelet. And, oh, texture. Texture, texture on top of texture. I wonder if these are each individual little flowers Hand or if she stitched. actually found fabric that looked like petals. Oh, that would have been a, that would have been a coin. One thing I do want to give a lovely, lovely shout out to is the fact that her shoes match her mother's hair. That's yes, beautiful. Man. I, I love it. I love she is wearing bright yellow hair and bright yellow pumps. She's advertising the pollen. Got a toot for I me. give it a toot. I love it. It's beautiful. Her makeup looks great. The styling is beautiful. It's very kind of like, you know. Soft, oh. easy, breezy. Yeah. Innocent girl just got to the big city. Okay. Uh -huh. Color toot. Toot. Shangela, and she is extra. So extra. This. As extra as Beyonce was doing this for you. Girl, completely. I was about to say, she got real inspiration from Beyonce because she carried with that. Beyonce is an ongoing theme mm -hmm. in uh, RuPaul's Drag Race history. She has been mentioned probably more times than RuPaul has been mentioned. Shut your mouth. <laughs> I love how extra it is. I love that she's wearing all these flowers. I think she executed it really well considering the, the, con uh, the constraints, mm -hmm. and, but she still gave us exactly what she was doing with Beyonce's photo shoot. I, yeah. I, I, as soon as I saw it, I knew what it was. Yeah. It's a two. Two. I give it a two. <laughs> I give it an extra two just for being extra. How many months do you think she is? 14. Oh, she's way past due. <laughs> All right, up next we have the queen, Miss Bibi Zahara Benet. Bibi Zahara Benet in beige and black. It looks like feathers. It looks more like feathers. It's giving me like a seductive crow. But I love it. It's still beautiful. Because if I were gonna go this route, I would either do this, because you know me, I'm a nightmare in beige. Uh -huh. Or I would be a nightmare in black. <laughs> it's beautiful, but I just wish that she would have like done some more detail. Yeah, it looks like she could use a, like a different shade of flower. Just to have some kind of contrast with or the maybe black. Paint. There's, there's or she could have even on the yeah. on the tips of the petals, just to give it more detail. Yeah. Done like uh, silver glittery tips or something, frosted tips, just to give it a little more detail to break up the black. I love it though. It's beautiful. It's, it's still getting a two for me. I'll give it a two. Mm. Kennedy Davenport. This is beautiful. I would run in those flower fields any day. I love chewing on sunflower seeds. That's not an invitation for Kai Kai, but I mean. I love how the yellow is a contrast to the black. It's gorgeous. It's kind of like, eh, yeah. You did the assignment. Yeah, she did this up. I'm not understanding. Is that wheat sticking out of her hair? Looks like pussy willows. 
Pussy Willow. Oh, well. She what was, are those? She was feeling her pussy. Pussy Willow's daddy. Pussy Willow's daddy ankle. Oh, it's gonna be a two. But they're me. fake, so yeah, she did it. Um, it's a two. I just, it's kind of what we've come to expect from Kennedy, where it's just extra. Okay. I think I would have liked it on a different color dress. It just, it's so off-putting looking at this black velvet gown with flower, with with sunflowers on it. Well, you know, I think I would have been bored if the backdrop to the flat the sunflowers would have been an autumn color. I think it would have been. No, too. it could have been blue. Oh, like sunflowers against a blue sky. Yeah, it could have been anything, but black. It's just, I don't know. It just, I wish there was more a little pop of color. Yeah. And it, and we're seeing like with BB, it's like cascading down one side and gathering at the hip and then flooding at the bottom. It's kind of like, okay, yeah. let's the silhouette, The new. silhouette is starting to become predictable. This but I like what she did with the petals on the face. Yeah. Two. I give it a two. This yeah. next queen is Chi Chi Devane. And it's a boot. A boot. It's uh, a boot. It's, what, it's, you what know. What is it? It looks like uh, stargazers. Night lilies, stargazers. Just, Even in the what? picture, she's like, what the f am I doing? Right, this, you know what? what this is look this? is something that I would expect from uh, her respective season. This is All Stars Love, and that right there, it, and that's not cutting it. Love the hair, face looks lovely, but you'd get a C minus for me for this assignment. It's a boob. It's a boob. I don't like the cut of the skirt, I don't like the proportions, the fact that she bought just a handful of flowers. Yeah, and when, okay, one here, one here, and then it looks like she measured. Okay. <laughs> Well, you gotta ration them. <laughs> yeah. You gotta ration them. I don't know. Them. It just, it looks. Not it, going back to the store. Go in, bitch. And there's so much, like one bush. It looks like she just bought one bushel. Yeah. To cover the top. And and then those are stones on the skirt. And then the beads are, it's just, it's a boot. Yeah. All right, you guys. This is Miss Trixie Mattel. In her signature pink. Those are two distinctive different colors of pink. Blush and bashful. I like this. It's a lot more lace than it is flower to me. Yeah. Uh, when I look at this, I wouldn't think, ooh, flower. I would think more lacy. I think more girly, uh, you know, and then with the kitty cats on the sides, not really florally to yeah, me. Yeah, she's, but uh, I'm seeing a pattern with um, Trixie other than the pink and the blonde. It's like she's really in this like whole hippie vibe with, it seems to be a trend in all of her looks and her silhouettes. But it's still beautiful and I think it's well done. It's a so it's a toot for me. I'll give it a toot. Miss Bindela Creme. I mean. You know what? If we were going off of this look to judge the winner of All Stars 3, it would be Bindela Creme. She just set herself completely apart from the other girls with this. Yeah. Do you know what this kind of reminds me of? Remember her, the, the outfit she made? in season six with her box of goodies. Um, and she, it was a Golden Girls theme. Yes. It kind of reminds me of that. So, and of course, like we were saying with Trixie, she's got a silhouette, she's got a, 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 a brand. Yeah. And so does Ben. It's very nipped in at the waist, a nice full bosom, a nice full Flare out at the rump, bottom. And then, yeah, this is beautiful. Absolutely. It's Beautiful. always so impeccable. The shape, the detail she puts in, this is an absolute toot for me. Girl, bravo, bitch, bravo. It's a shoot. Oh, sh Babe, yeah. Oh, I think this is the first shoot. shoot we've given out this season. Trend alert! Lady pollen. Pollens of ladies. Brings all the bees to the yard. <laughs> <laughs> Donkey stung. Donkey punch. Hated it. <laughs> Our, Our top, top two of the week is Ben de la Creme. Ah, yes. You smell so fresh mm. and so clean. I want to smell your petal. Ew. <laughs> after, a fresh, <laughs> after a fresh morning dew. Shh. Tune in to VH1 at 8 p.m. on Thursdays for our all new episode of RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars Season 3. And for our international fans and viewers out there in the world that do not live in the United States of America and you are looking for a place to watch RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars Season 3, you will go to the description below and you will find the link and where to go to subscribe to WOW Presents Plus for $3.99. 
and view RuPaul's Drag Race All-Star Season 3. If it's, it's available in your country. Thanks for that, bitch. <laughs> Ooh, I like your lip color too. Oh, thanks. Nice. It's nice. You look awesome. So, you look awesome, Blossom. <laughs> I see what you did there. Mmm, I farted.